Live from Raleigh, you're watching WRAL News in High Definition with Bill Leslie, Pam Zolsby, and meteorologist Elizabeth Gardner. Coverage you can count on. And teaching sportsmanship to the kids and some parents. More on the new effort launched in Wake County. And keeping it cool, the new program in Wake County aimed at keeping parents tame while on the sidelines. You're watching WRAL News in high definition. You play to win, but sometimes it can be taken to extremes. You've heard of parents losing it on the sidelines of a child's game. Well, a new program is being launched in Wake County to get a handle on the outrage. It's called I-9, and Jeff Atkins is the program director. Jeff, good to have you with us. Appreciate it, Brian. Has America moved away from good sportsmanship, and if so, why? I think uh, sports programs now are getting very highly competitive, uh, trying to win at all costs, that type of thing. and. Uh, we're trying to bring it back to the original fun and sportsmanship side of things. Now, parents, coaches, and psychologists agree that pressure and competition in youth sports are uh, intense. And, and how do you deal with that with, with your particular program? Well, we start off first by background checks and screening all of our coaches and volunteers. Um, all the parents, before a child even steps on the field, they have to commit to a parental pledge which says that we have a no-tolerance policy for any type of sideline, interruptive sideline behavior. Wow. So it sounds like your message is, lighten up, have some fun, kids. Exactly. And mom and dad. Exactly. We, uh, we focus and emphasize the fun and learning good sportsmanship values and things like that. It's, um, it's, been, a good, it's been a good run, really. So did this effort just grow out of just uh, the, the growing incidence of, of, of athletic rage? I, I believe so. I believe that's where it started. I mean, the, the roots of it started there, but uh, it's also looking more into parents' uh, schedules as well. Uh, we have a, a, a unique fit to parents' lifestyles now, and they don't have to uh, have sports dictate what they do. We play on the weekends, and we also practice on the weekends, so the time commitment is, is uh, basically a couple hours on a Saturday, and they have the rest of the week and things like that to do with what they want to with the families. And, and what can parents do to set a better example for their kids? Uh, they can encourage their kids. Uh, they can, you know, get out and teach them the fundamentals of the game that we're doing in practice. They can, they can work on the sportsmanship values that we talk about in practice. Uh, we actually award medals and um, um, excellence in sportsmanship value medals to the kids. So um, it's not just about the MVP. It's about the ones that are exhibiting those types of values on the field. All right, Je Jeff Adkins, thanks so much. With I-9. And Appreciate for more information on I-9 and how it uh, can be a part of your life, go to WRL.com and click web links. Pamela. Thank you, Billy. And uh, let's talk about the weather and kids, boys and girls who might be on a playing field this weekend. That's right.